What's up guys, Wade Willis here for Wade Reacts, here for episode 2 of Blue Period. The first episode really set the tone for the story. I thought it did a really good job of showing what's at stake for the main character. Um, he is, he's intelligent, but he's not naturally gifted. He has to work hard for everything he gets. He realizes that the one time he did a painting, it unlocks something that he hasn't ever felt before and he decides he wants to go down this path which is super risky because if he just went down the normal path he was supposed to go down his life would be pretty set and he would have a comfortable fine life but he wouldn't be happy but yeah guys I'm so excited for the rest of this season and don't forget to like the video subscribe to the channel for tons of anime reactions and review videos and yeah, jump on the way train. Let's go. Go. Great OP. Yeah, and um, we haven't met too many characters. We've been introduced to some characters, but just by the opening, I can see that there's a lot of characters we haven't even really gotten to know yet. Um, and one of the things I really liked in the first episode, when he did his painting, he was able to kind of like have the conversation he wanted to have with his friends and with people about what Shibuya looked just like what Shibuya looked like in the morning and it was kind of crazy his friends are kind of like um uh, they're they're kind of like burnouts a bit So true. If I was a teacher, I would be... <laughs> Jeez.
That is so much work. That's what makes you gets you so much better though. <laughs> hmm. That's true. And believe me, I'm no expert on art. Um, I just kind of, a lot of the stuff that they talk about improving, like in this, the concepts, like I wrestled my whole life and um, I wasn't like the most talented, but I worked harder than everyone and I was, able to get scholarships and stuff but I worked at getting better at like every facet and that's what helped me improve so quickly Oh. For those of you that have like done art classes, is this like pretty normal? Well, you're also the newest, dude. Oh no. That's the worst way for her to find out.
it's interesting two of the shows i've liked the most this year have been kind of based on art because nagatoro had that is a major aspect too Yeah, you have to learn the techniques to be able to do like what ideas actually come to your mind. Is she gonna see his art? Damn. Yeah, you have to support him at that point. Oh my gosh, who made the figure? <laughs> That's so cool. Dang, the freaking tennis racket one is. Wow. Jeez. But he's got a, uh, Yeah, he's so much better. This is such a... Uh, I'm surprised they did the time jump this much. Although I don't know what happened in the story. So maybe that's just how it is. Correct. I'm kind of worried about her. <laughs> I was kind of worried she wasn't going to make it and
Wow. Oil painting. If you were good, you could make way more money doing art than most things. But, like, you have to be, like, top 0.001%. Did she actually graduate? Oh. Good lord, that, that painting was so epic. Dang, gorgeous.
Jeez. I mean, as a mom, how do you not freaking get crushed by that? I feel like in America, it's a little bit, it's a, well, it's a lot of it less of a risk because let's say you go through, you choose art school and then you, re, it doesn't work out. If you were, had really good grades in high school and you did really well in art school, you can get into a good regular college. I mean, you're going to be in a ton of debt probably, but. But I feel like in Japan, you're kind of like stuck on a path. I could be wrong, though. Yeah, another really, really good episode. Um, yeah, this show's just... I'm uh, I'm really impressed. Um, I mean, yeah, it's gorgeous. I like seeing all the stuff into the art. And I never took an art class growing up. And, it, like, if I talk about how, like, oh, yeah, that's definitely right, it's just because of, like, a lot of concepts of being good at anything are similar uh, and then obviously the technical things in art I have no idea about. So I find that extremely interesting. And I really like the characters. And I feel like the path that we're kind of growing down uh, is very unique for a show. Um, and maybe there's a lot that out there that I for anime that, that are similar to this that I just I've never known about. Um, Maybe I'm I'm stuck down a, a particular path of anime that I usually watch, but uh, yeah, this is just very good. Really, um, characters are so well written. The story is so well written. I'd be curious to know if this is um, based on like real events uh, for a character or someone he knows or he or she. Okay, so that was that was great. I'm really excited to. Um, I don't know how many episodes there's going to be for this. I think it's twelve. Maybe it's more. Um, I I feel like it's gonna be twelve based on, um, kind of. Pacing, especially the fact that they um, sped through the whole like month of summer, but I, I could be wrong because, but yeah, there's just so much more that can happen um, that I'm excited to see, like how the relationships change, what it's like when he's around different people from other places. Uh, obviously, at this. I'm assuming he's going to be, like, really bad compared to everyone else at this thing at first. And he's probably going to see kind of, like, an underbelly and a competitive side that is uh, probably kind of gross. 
to him that for people that are vying for like top levels at anything, you usually see that a lot. So um, that's just something I, I, I have no idea if that's what's going to happen, but I'm, I'm kind of expecting it. Um, and I think it'll be pretty interesting to kind of see that. But yeah, the, the, I'm sure the competition level at this at this prep school is going to be insane. So I'm I'm pumped to see what happens. But yeah, let me know what you guys think in the comments below.